GBTV is brought to you by Grand Blank CTE. Check. Super. I got this girl and she wants me to. Super. I told her I'll come scoop her around and she said. Super. That sounds great. Shorty girl's a trooper. No matter what I need her to do, she'd be like. Super. Hi, I'm Jen. I've been working at High School West Cafeteria for three years now. What's your favorite part of the job? You guys. I love, I love meeting all the kids and talking to the kids and learning all about you. What do you enjoy about your job? It's fun. It's, it's not stressful. It's a lot of fun. We have a lot. Our, our group of, wim, of women here have a blast, and we have we. I don't know, we just have a lot of fun and there's nothing that I dread about coming to work. Why do you go out of your way to learn everyone's names? I don't know why I started doing it. Well, when, our first, when we first, we have a yearly meeting and our boss tells us to make sure we are making sure we're looking at faces and like putting names and faces together so we can make sure nobody's, you know, stealing lunches or whatever. But I guess I just took it to the next level and I, I, now I like to know, you know, when you guys tell me you had a bad weekend or you had a great weekend or where you work or your sports or any of that. I, it's, it's interesting and I think every single one of you are great kids and I love to talk to you. What is the hardest and easiest part of your job? Coming in on a Monday, <laughs> it's not too much of a hard part, but um, I do wash dishes for quite a while at the end of the day. My back hurts from that, but other than that, it's pretty easy. What is your home life like? I've been married to my husband for eight years. Um, I have a 13-year-old and we have a 7-year-old. Um, he actually works out of state all the time, so I'm home alone with the kids most of the time while he's working. Um, but I started working here because my youngest went to school, so I had the perfect hours here while the kids were at school. And then two birds, a fish, not much else. What is one thing you would say to GB? I don't know. It's been a, it's been a great time. It's been a great opportunity. I love working here. And like I said, I really do think every single one of you kids has such special qualities. And I love to see you smile and laugh and joke. That's it. And now to GBTV weather with our new weatherman, Zaid. Today, we've got a high of 63, low of 47 with probably cloudy conditions. Sorry, can you slow Tomorrow, down a bit? Tomorrow, we've got a high of 52, low of 43 with rainy conditions. Ooh, get that raincoat on. Sunday, we've got a high of 52, low of 40 with probably cloudy conditions. Monday, we've got a high of 56, low of 39 with probably cloudy conditions. Tuesday, we've got a high of 59, low of 41 with probably cloudy conditions. Wednesday, we've got a high of 62, low of 45 with probably cloudy conditions. Thursday, we've got a high of 63, low of 49 with probably cloudy conditions. And finally, for Friday, we've got a high of 62, low of 47, and you guessed it. Probably cloudy, cloudy conditions. conditions. Yep. Okay. Well, we gave that a shot. Can we get Jack Briggs out here for the weather?
have a new guest on set, Mr. Getzinger. Hello. Today, Bobcats, we want to s- <sighs> Crap, I thought they were going to open that door. Do you think you have good Riz or an amazing pickup line that'll get- <laughs> How do you think your Riz is? Do you have an amazing pickup line you'd like to share with us? Today, we went around East Campus Lunch and asked people to show us their Riz and to share with us a pickup line. Can you tell us your best pickup line? Let me think for a second. Uh, my best pickup line is- are you a ticket because you're so fine? That's a good one. I like that one. Are you from Tennessee? Because you're the only 10 I see. That's what oh, I No, I'm doing a two man. We're finding a two man right now. How y'all doing today? Good. 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 Hey, me and my boy Capper just like want to know what y'all having for lunch today. Show me what y'all got. No, I think the better question is more like, what are you guys doing this weekend? Like, I got open, like, I really got open crib, like. Yeah, like, I got open crib, like. Yeah, you got my Snapchat, bro. Oh, hey, three men? <laughs> hey, you guys got a third? Hey, three. You got a third? Hey, Lauren! <laughs> yeah, Lauren! <laughs> yeah, sir, though. Thank you, guys. All right, hey. Look, okay, hey, hey, you got my Snapchat, though. I'm not too sure. Are you tired? Because you've been running through my mind all day long. That's a good one. That's a good one. You've been running through my mind all day. They say that kissing is a love language. So would you mind starting a conversation with me? <laughs> okay. Stop it. Get some help. What's your best pickup line? Are you are you from Tennessee? Yes. Cool. No, no. <laughs> Hi. Oh no. God. Are you are you, are you Google? No. Because you're everything I've been searching for. Okay. <laughs> That's Asian Club is a club about diversity. It's a way to meet new people, make new friends, eat new food, experience different cultures. This is a really fun place to be around. Anybody and everybody can join the Asian Club. We got people from all different ethnical backgrounds, all cultures. We just want a place where people can just like come, hang out, have fun, absolutely anybody and everybody. The benefits of joining Asian Club or, well, of course repeated, but you get to meet new people, like you get to experience new foods. If you're ever hungry, you can come by. Even if it's not for like the whole time, you can stop by whenever, you can leave whenever. Just make sure you have fun. Meetings are normally led by our four leaders, me, Shnuk Das, Noor Almunajed, Kishta Vigasia, and Vincent Lee. Normally start off with either a presentation, a brief overview of what we're doing for the day. If we have food, which we normally do, we present that out there. And we normally just let everybody do their own thing. Sometimes we may, may do something culturally significant. Sometimes we may do like, we're watching a movie or watching soccer games like we're doing today. Asian Club normally meets every two weeks on one of either Tuesday, Wednesday, or Thursday at West Campus Flex Lab. We hope to see you here. The club's fun, everybody's fun. Bring a friend, have fun. I'm already tired. I need to stop drinking the soda. I need, I need to start running or something. That's what we're supposed to do, right? That's being techie. I don't know how to move my feet. What is this then? Oh, I gotta make it up as I go. Hey, I'm not kidding. No. Stop. I can't do that when y'all laughing with me. Dude, Alex, come on. My grandma can pass better than you, buddy. Suck. Oh. 
This is why you ride the bench. <laughs> I'm about to beat the bricks off this boy. Chucks my ball like that. Who do you think he is? Exactly. Ah. Ah. Stop that. Dude, I'm, I'm already tired. I gotta take a break. I don't know why I do this. Too much running. Dude, that's like the first time I've ever seen Jackson Harchick save a ball like that. Holy crap. Oh. <laughs> Dude, how do you bake and push me? <laughs> ah, I got a touch on it, bro. I'll score hey, just for the mic. Oh my god, he played me. No! There. Yeah, Boosh missed too, bro. I think it's the yellow team jinx. Dude, I might have to go again. I feel like I gotta redeem myself. Never missed twice. GB Soccer has its last regular season game this Monday at Bay City Central at 4.30. And make sure to pull up for our first district opening game against Lapeer at the Don at 7.00. See you there. And as a reminder, if you want your team mic'd up, to make sure to contact us at GBTV and we'll get you on the show. Perspective is the particular way of seeing the world or the world from your own personal point of view. Today, we're gonna get the perspective of Dum Dums. No, it's on Dum Dums. No, it's of Dum Dums. No, it's on Dum Dums. Wait, like the sucker? Yeah. Oh. Cherry? Mm. What? <laughs> Wait. Dum Dum. It tastes like crap. <laughs> Um, this one's tough. <laughs> what would you have your eyes closed? Lemon lime. What? Mm -hmm. What? Yeah, strawberry. Strawberry? Lemon lime? This does not taste like a strawberry. Now I get second for uh, uh, Cherry, right? Is it cherry? Oh, you can turn around now. I also saw the colors. that count? Like sour or something. Right, I got, I got. It. I'm ready. Yes. I'm ready. Officially, I'm going lime. Lemon lime. Lemon lime doesn't count. Do I get it? It counts. It counts. I'll take it. Let's go. That's the dub.